Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. Hey, hey! Yes, Jesus loves me, for the Bible tells me so. What a sobering, encouraging, enlightening, empowering, reviving, good God Almighty, uplifting <laughs> thought to think that I am loved by the God of the Bible, to think that you are loved by the God of the Bible, to know that the God of the Bible loves us. Hey, while you're watching this, while you're watching this, just let, just if you're where you can, think about it for a moment. Just exhale and go, <sighs> but the Lord loves me. The Lord loves me. That, that's what I'm going to be talking about tonight. We are loved by the God of the Bible. And that is a marvelous thing to keep in mind because saints, often the devil tries to cause us in this crazy, topsy-turvy world to forget that we are under the auspices of his love. We're under the shadow of his wings and that he is going to take care of us. And I want to talk tonight about his love. And I want to talk about how that love is manifested. And I want to talk about the effects of his love. The, the effects of his love. How it causes us to respond to him as well as how we are to respond to one another. Now, I'm as high as I can be. Last night, we were in Burlington, North Carolina, uh, North Carolina, third jurisdiction. I'm on a jurisdictional tour. We were with the saints in Burlington uh, with uh, the mighty stone, Pastor Chris Stone at his church there. And what a move of God we had there uh, in Burlington, North Carolina at our rally. So tonight, 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 I'm inviting all the members and everyone who will see this, to come on out. I'm going to talk about the love of Jesus. I'm going to talk about the fact that Christianity, the Old and the New Testament, the Bible, is the greatest love story ever told. And the Lord's love is going to keep us and strengthen us. It's going to correct us. It's going to inspire us. In fact, because the Lord loves me. I can overcome. I can defeat the enemy. You can. We can do whatever it is that the Lord has placed in our hands to do. We can overcome any and every attack that Satan will send our way because his love gives us the ability to do so. Now I'm going to talk about it tonight. Meet me at church. It's summertime. It's hot. You know the you watch the news and they're saying, it's going to be hot today. Well, it's July. In North Carolina, there's nothing like a North Carolina summer. Full of humidity. We get, we get uh, showers and rain. Uh, the storm comes and they go. But you know what? God watches over us. Be glad that you're alive. Don't complain so much about the heat. It's so hot. Let the heat re remind you to stay safe. <laughs> And if you're not saved, this heat is talking to you because hell is many, 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 many times hotter than July in North Carolina. Now, that's a good reason to get saved, isn't it? But tonight we're talking about his love and I want to see you here as we study the word of God together. Oh, yes, Jesus loves me and he loves you too. Yes, Jesus loves me. For the Bible tells me so. <laughs> I love you. I'll see you tonight.